How's it going guys? So, as you can already tell by my channel, um, I've been doing a lot of Pokemon competitive battling, or getting sort of prepped up for it to actually go to some tournaments along with my buddy Drew, who's uh, another Pokemon competitive battler, and um, it seems like I'm interested in going back into the competitive field of gaming, as in I actually do want to go to a tournament and whatnot. So, uh, as you can already tell from my channel, again, it's mostly been about Pokemon, but lately I've also been watching a lot of the fighting game for, uh, a lot of the fighting games, mostly from Evolution 2011, which was the first time I've, I'd ever watched something like that, um, where they hosted Street Fighter, the new Mortal Kombat, and they also host, I think, um, Tekken, I believe. So, um, it, it just really catched my interest, and, uh, I would like to give a fighting game for competitive wise I would like to give a fighting game a go so I'm not too sure which one because I'm definitely gonna talk to my buddy Drew about this because uh, more than likely it'll be both me and him going into that field as well just because uh, we've de we played a lot of Tekken back in our uh, days and uh, we would definitely love to give a uh, fighting game tournament a go but um, Lately, it's I've been watching a lot of you know Street Fighter um, competitive vids. I've been watching a lot of Smash Brothers Melee competitive vids, and I've been watching a lot of Tekken vids. And um, I love all. Th well, I I can't say I love all three games. I like two of the three. Street Fighter I was never too good at, but I when I when I was watching uh, Evolution 2011 between the match between. Uh, Daigo, and I hope I pronounced his name right, but uh, Daigo and Punko, um, it just kind of inspired me. It was just like, wow, that, you know, that's awesome. I love how the crowd was actually really hyped about that match, and uh, it just seemed awesome. I mean, I can imagine the uh, the uh, adrenaline that was going between both of those players at the time, but it just seemed awesome, and. Uh, I haven't watched a lot of Mortal Kombat, even though Mortal Kombat is my favorite fighting game series of all time. But uh, I think in the competitive wise, it's kind of stale compared to, say, Street Fighter or Tekken. But even then, Tekken also seems a little stale. But I guess Street Fighter is just one of the, you know, it's definitely one of the more popular games. Especially because, you know, you got people in that uh, game like Daigo, who's just been the reigning champion and just until this year i believe but um so the competitive uh fighting game fighting game competitive wise uh <laughs> i'm sorry i'm a little tired right now so i'm i'm bum i'm juggling my words as i speak but the games i've been mostly looking at video wise was um definitely it was street fighter then it, um it was street fighter tekken and melee the reason Melee over Brawl is not because I like Melee over Brawl. I actually do like Brawl a little bit more. But I think for competitive field-wise, all the commentators that do Brawl, it's people make it seem way too technical than it already is. I can understand if you're going to throw terms like SDI, DI, all that stuff out there. But it just seems way too technical than it is. I mean... Granted, every fighting game is going to have that technicality towards it, especially in the competitive field for commentating, I guess just to make it seem a lot harder than it is or just to get everyone excited or whatnot. <laughs> but uh, it, Brawl Brawl's just way too technical in the sense. And plus, a lot of people use Meta Knight. I've looked at the Smashboards website and just a lot of people use Meta Knight. And that just... It just leaves a bad taste in my mouth, and it's just like, nah, no thanks. Um, then again, a lot of people use, uh, who's that fat guy in Tekken 6? I think Bob's his name, <laughs> which is funny. But, uh, yeah, so that one character, or, no, actually, a lot of people in the Tekken use, like, Law, I think, and they also use, uh, that fat guy, Bob, although I've, I have never, I haven't played Tekken since Tekken 4, so I'm very rusty, and probably Drew is too, because I can only remember the last Tekken game we did play was number 4, 
And uh, as for Street Fighter, I just plain suck at Street Fighter. I was never that good. I was I was much better at like Fatal Fury or Bloody Roar or any of those fighting games. I just sucked at Street Fighter. But um, I from all the videos I've been watching and sort of the inspiration, I guess you could say, I've been getting. Um, I would love to give a fighting game, or yeah, I would, I would love to give a fighting game a chance in the competitive field. I would love to go to a fighting game tournament just to see if I could even place top 10. Mainly it's just for fun. I mean, this really isn't like a long-term goal. It's more of a short term just to do it for fun. I mean, you know, <laughs> it's just for fun for the most part. Like uh, Pokemon, you know, again, me and Drew, it's it's already settled. We are going to go to a Pokemon tournament whenever they host it around our area. Whenever that'll be. But uh, we're definitely going to go to a Pokemon tournament. Um, yeah, excuse me. <laughs> and uh, um, as for fighting games, um, I'm definitely going to have to talk, over, talk it all over with my buddy Drew. Um, in fact, Drew, you're probably going to watch this vid, so hit it up with a comment just to give me your thoughts and opinions. But uh, more than likely, we're, also, we're probably going to also try out a fighting game competitive-wise just to go into a tournament and see. More than likely, it's going to be one of the top three I've already said between Tekken, Street Fighter, or Melee. Uh, Tekken right now is... If Tekken is... Excuse me. Tekken and Melee are definitely the top contenders of the two just because those are the two that me and Drew are most familiar with. Street Fighter, not so much, only in the simple fact that uh, we really don't play Street Fighter that much, nor have we ever played Street Fighter that much. But uh, anyways, this is just a short little vid just to tell you guys what's uh what me and andrew at the time or andrew <laughs> me and drew have been doing or have been thinking about doing for the time being whether it be short term or long term um more than likely it's going to be short term but we're just you know we're just doing this stuff for fun if we actually do make it for some reason in whatever competitive game we do decide to do if we do make it in a tournament then uh I'll probably sit there and wonder how the fuck did we do it because we suck for most of the games that we play. But, uh, anyways, this vid's already gone long enough. Uh, it should have been wrapped up a long time ago. Like I said, though, I'm pretty tired right now, so I'm sorry if I've been rambling on or whatnot. Uh, pretty much, that's, that's about it. That's all I wanted to say, really, so... Mainly for right now also, just keep looking out for Pokemon vids, just because, well, Pokemon's fun. <laughs> so, anyways guys, um, yeah, I'm looking at the time on my phone right now, so uh, I'll see you guys around. Take care, have a nice day, um, expect more Pokemon vids in the future, and uh, Drew, uh, hit up this vid, let me know what you think about a fighting game for competitive-wise. Alright, later guys. Take care, everybody.